Main articles. Invasion of Naboo. Supreme Chancellor election. 32 BBY and separatist crisis. I have good news for you, my lord. The war has begun. Excellent. Everything is going as planned. Darth Tyrannus and Darth Sidious, listen, file info. The imperial ideals of the Galactic Empire could be dated back to the Sith Empire of the Old Republic's time period. Following the defeat of the Sith during their final war with the Jedi Order, for at least a thousand years, the dominant governing body of the galaxy was the unicameral, parliamentary, and democratic Galactic Republic, which was governed by the Galactic Senate and led by an elected Supreme Chancellor. In the last decades of its existence, the Republic Senate became embroiled in bureaucracy, rendering it woefully ineffectual as a governing body. Darth Sidious, the Dark Lord of the Sith known publicly as Senator Sheev Palpatine of Naboo, privately lamented the declining state of the Senate, noting that the Republic was not what it once was. Thirteen years before the Republic's end as a democracy, Darth Sidious orchestrated the invasion of Naboo by the Trade Federation in order to create a leadership crisis in the Senate. Sidious used the crisis to manipulate the then Queen of the Naboo, Padme Amidala, into calling a vote of no confidence against sitting Supreme Chancellor Finnis Valerum. The vote passed, and in the subsequent election, Sidious, in his public persona of Senator Palpatine of Naboo, secured the position of Supreme Chancellor of the Galactic Republic for himself through a strong sympathy vote. Ultimately, he would be the last individual to hold this office. In the decade that followed, Sidious secretly manipulated galactic events to the extent that war became inevitable. Besides persuading a dead Jedi master, Sifo Dias, to create a secret clone army, he also tasked his Sith apprentice, Darth Tyrannus, with exacerbating political tensions in the Republic and engineering a separatist crisis. These actions would culminate in the outbreak of the Clone Wars held on Geonosis, the last conflict of the Republic, while Sidious himself, reluctantly, accepted emergency powers from the Senate.